Welcome to the Adventure with Rock activity. In your packages this week, you will have an alphabet chart where you can play the alphabet game with using your rock. Okay, and then there's a number chart. You can find as many rocks and count them. There, there's also a sheet that you can put your pet rock on to create your craft. It's called Pet Rock Craft. And another sheet for you to find rocks and pebbles and see the different sizes, okay? So as you go outdoors and find some rocks to do your activity, enjoy the video along with us and have some adventure. Hello everyone, this is Joan from early on. I'm outdoors on a nice sunny day, picking up rocks. As you can see over there, lots of rocks, all different sizes and shapes. I'm here to pick up rocks for a craft activity. I have brought my bin with me, which I'll be filling up. I'm getting big rocks small pebbles. The smaller ones are called pebbles. Okay, so I'm going to take as many as I need and I'll meet you back at early on. Hello everyone. I'm back at early on site with all the rocks that I collected. This is my bin with the remaining rocks and these are all the rocks that were in the bin. So I'm going to paint them and then we will add some colors and some letters and some words but I'm going to paint them quietly so you can watch but you need to join me in painting as well and at the end I'll show you what it looks like okay so I'm stirring my paint and I'm going to get to work <laughs> There it is, boys and girls. The painting is done on the rocks. It says early on rocks. Early on rocks. And this is another one of the big rocks that I found. Just to show you, this is a rock. And from a rock, we have a pebble, which is a smaller rock. Possibly this was broken off from this bigger one and there's also smaller pebbles But boys and girls did you ever wonder where sand comes from? Sand this is some sand Very small small pieces sand is just tiny little rocks What happens is that over time rocks break apart it could be by the waves on the sea at the beach, on the beach, broken by the waves, by the rain or the wind. It all happens over time, okay? So this is sand. And I'll show you now how to separate the sand from the bigger pebbles. I'm going to be using a sift, which is like a strainer. Okay, then I'm gonna put it in here top of this container and I'm going to pour some sand with some pebbles and some other pieces of rocks and I'm going to see how it separates to show you the smaller ones from the bigger ones. Shake, shake, shake. As you can see in the bin, it's almost like small sand dust. So you can see that in the bin? Continue to sift it. And sift on the bottom as well. So it's separating the bigger ones from the little ones. So here we have some pebbles. Because it's leaving after shifting it, it's leaving the bigger ones on top. 
okay and then in the bin we have the finder set it's almost like dirt but it's very tiny 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 rocks see that it can move so fast there it is tiny rocks broken apart from the pebbles and the pebbles broken apart from the big rocks different stages rock cycle then continue to sift your rocks if you want to have more sand maybe you could try it at home sometime study of rocks is called geology so we're all going to be geologists this week people who study rocks are called geologists and rocks can be found all over okay in your package this week i'll be sending home a special rock for you so you can decorate design as you wish you paint it you could design it any way you like it's just for you and i have a poem it's called little pebbles pebbles are small rocks okay so we have them right here poem goes like this five little pebbles looking at me am i from the sea am i from the shore am i from the mountain where did you find me now this is my home as the poem says where did you find me you can pick rocks up anywhere you go so they're all over so be sure to look at our videos and learn much more about rocks okay From the rocks I've collected, I've made an ABC chart, an ABC and E stone, and we turned those things along with me so you can follow along. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, U, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? After three, one, two, three. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Thank you for singing with me. Rocks in my pockets, rocks in my pockets, big and small, big and small. Shiny little pebbles, shiny little pebbles, found them all, found them all. Stepping over stepping stones, one, two, three. Stepping over stepping stones, come with me. The river's very wide, we'll step across on stepping stones to reach the other side. Today's craft, I'll be using a rock to make a bunny. I need some sticker eyes. I already put my eyes on for time. And I have some glue, a bit of red paint, and cotton balls, okay? First of all, I'll be putting some glue on all over the rock so I can get my cotton balls to stick on real well if the cotton balls are too big we can just tear them apart and ball them up roll them up and stick on there so we get a good fit onto the wrap okay start putting your cotton ball on remember not to cover the eyes All around the sides here, on top. If we need another piece down here, and boys and girls, bunnies have cotton tails. So we're gonna put a big piece at the back, just to show his cotton tail. So once our rock is all covered, we may use 
red paint to give him a red nose. Make sure his eyes are not covered. And he has a big cotton tail here. There you go. Maybe we might need a little piece on the hair. Put some more glue at the side and some more glue at the side. And get a little small piece of cotton ball. Remember to roll it up. And stick it on his cheeks. So he's all covered up. Let's see if we need a little piece from here to make it all nice and fuzzy. Okay, there you go. That's our bunny rabbit. And before that, boys and girls, I made a pet bird. So you can make whatever you like. This is a bird. So once you get your wrap in your package, you can begin to make whatever you like with your wrap. It's my pet bird. And this is my bunny rabbit. This cotton tail.